Well, hello again, all my fluid art friends. Here's the video you've been waiting for. The star of the show, the Golden Fluid Acrylics. Including even the Iridescent Gold Fine. Ah, oh, isn't that so pretty? And I'm going to do another flip cup. Um... I'm hoping that they don't mix as much as the other two colors did. I, I don't know if it was just the wrong colors or what, but, I mean, we'll find out. Come on, separate. Give me a cup, okay? I guess I'll have to take the cup from the top. Okay, so, I have the colors listed down in the description. But you can see from these that they're pretty, pretty, um... Um, what do you, uh, bright, okay, this is the yellow, okay, and I'm going to do two layers like I did in the other one, I don't know if I'm going to use them all up, see, with the golden, because they're so thick, you end up having to put more medium in there, and I ended up putting more than I wanted to in there, and that's where I got the, uh, mm, let me do, well, okay, let me do just a little bit of black, and a little bit of gold, this came out thinner than I thought it should, but I didn't know what else to do, okay, yellow, I'm not going to put all of it in here. Well, I'm going to see how much I got with two layers of each color. And I might use the rest to go around the outside of the flip cup. And there is my blue. Oh, I dripped. And um, if any of the fam are watching, I know what you're thinking. Just think it to yourself. Don't type below. Yes, I know I dripped. And for those of you that don't know what it is, I'm not telling you because it's kind of an adult thing, okay? And I don't know what kids are watching. It's just a little joke we have amongst our, our, our ATD fan. Okay. Uh, I got about four ounces in there, it looks like. Oh, see, I didn't keep it down. Oh, okay, now... I'm going to put some of the gold around it. I don't need to put it on the other side because of the, um, it leaked out the other side because I wasn't holding it right. Oh, well. Mistakes happen. Maybe that was a happy accident. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to put some of the yellow around here to help it. Some of the red, because this will probably all be tilted off. But I just want it to have some flow extender around it. Okay, and some of the blue. Just to help it along. And last but not least, I'm going to put my black on each corner. This one's thicker that for some reason. I was sitting here meticulously mixing it, believe me. Okay. Go right up against the edge with this. Okay, and now the paint should be all dripped out of the cup. So, let's see what kind of a magic it did. Okay. Oh, look at that. That's what I love about the golden paints. They happen to have the best mixing qualities with their um, with their colors. If I could afford it, I'm probably gonna I'm gonna try doing more most of my acrylic pouring in golden paints. Okay, I'm just taking what's left in my cup and getting it out along the edge of course I've gotten rid of everything so it's not in there anymore now let me straighten this guy out uh, torch it 
because there should be bubbles in them. There's no silicone in these paints, just like there was no silicone in the craft paints or in the Liquitex. Okay, let's see what I can get. Okay, I'm not going to take it off the corner yet. I'm just going to get it over to the corners. Get it all spread out. Okay. Now, I'm going to see how if I can get it off the corner. Yep, there it went. And off that corner. And off that corner. Now, I'm going to try stretching all of it down. Now, I'm going to stop and take a look at it to see if I want to do anything else. And I'm going to kind of touch up the corners just a little bit. Because I can see some bare white spots. Just doing the corners because it doesn't look like the sides got anything. Uh, so, tell me what you think. Is this? Of course, this is better. Golden is the star of the show, okay? I will be very, very honest. It always makes the most beautiful colors. Let's see if I can get some of this yellow to open up a little bit. Yep, see, I still got, it's running faster than I want it to, which means I still got a lot of paint on here. Okay, now let me take it back a little bit. And I've got a lot on the table, too. Okay, let me lift that up. I want to get rid of that yellow that's right there on the corner. So I'm going to try to get it to go off. And there it goes. I'm going to keep these two corners the way they are. But to tell you the truth, I like this. I see the blue. I see the blue right there. But I'm not doing anything else to it, okay? Um, so... I want to thank you all for watching. Please tell me down in the comments what you think is the best one. I, I know everybody's probably going to say golden. But you know what? If your budget can't afford it, craft paints look just as good too, okay? You know, if you get the right colors together. Oh, I got a big mess down here. I think I might... Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with what's down there. I don't know if I want to do skins or if I'm just... Because I'm not dipping another canvas. So, anyway, I will let you go. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Click like, share, comment, share. Hit the little bell for the notifications. Tell me what you think down in the comments. Um... And I hope to see you in my next video, which I don't know what I'll be doing in that one, but this is the last of the three tests, so um, let me uh, wipe my hands off and tell you all that I hope to see you in the next video, so bye for now.